what's good youtube we back in here with another episode of real street hustler today we your boy franklin we just posted up at the crib by the pool guys smoking some of this purple kush but in today's episode guys i'm gonna go down to punsby right now guys upgrade my jewelry because we still we did hit a nice little lick the last episode and i want to enjoy a little bit of this money we're gonna be selling our other old school in this episode guys to send in y'all know we're probably gonna have to take it down to the docks get it appraised and all that i'm gonna be selling my garage business in this episode because we, uh, we really can't do nothing with that business because once we get inside it you know what i'm saying we really can't do nothing but sell the cars and stuff like that and um i'm gonna be checking out another little business in here a little car rental business guys down at the airport we're gonna go on buy that in this episode and i'm gonna be getting a new whip once we sell our uh, old school in this episode, you know what I'm saying, to send me, we're going to go and drop that off. But for right now, guys, we going to the jury store, you know what I'm saying? We got to go and upgrade this little jury. We put in an order for some guys. We're going to pay 100000 for it, and it's ready for us to pick up. So I'm going to be taking the Caprice in this episode. We at our new crib right now. You know, we spent $1.2 mil for this crib. But the only thing I didn't like about this crib is that it looked just like my crib in the projects. I wish I could sell that crib in the projects, but I don't think with these these houses you can sell them or nothing like this. So we just gonna have to, you know what I'm saying, deal with it till we can get something better, you know what I'm saying? But let's go pick up this chain right now. Then I'm gonna go to the little garage business. We're gonna sell that, guys. I'm gonna go and let that go. Cause we really can't do nothing in there but like sell cars steal cars deliver cars we're gonna go check out a little rental company in this episode and you know what i'm saying we're gonna be renting out them hell cats we rent out them cats we got two hell cats we gotta look at two guys that send me that we're gonna be buying this episode because y'all know we gotta have cars at the little rental company so i'm gonna go and snatch them up say you want like eighty thousand for both of them and uh, I said we were picking up something new too in this episode. We spending like 400,000 for the new new, you know what I'm saying? 400,000, so y'all know it's gonna be something, something nice. But we're gonna leave that stock. We ain't put no rims on it. We're gonna leave it glass house. But y'all will see when we picking up once we get there, guys. But hopefully y'all enjoying y'all week and whatnot. We got a heavy schedule today. And instead of us just driving the two hell cats that we buy in this episode guys we're gonna just pay a rental company to drop them off at our little business just so you know what i'm saying we won't we won't have to take care of that we'll just pay somebody to do it we got the money right now we ain't hurting for nothing you know i hate to let this go too guys i hate to let it go but we in the money we in the money it's time to get something new you know what i'm saying make space for something else so yeah guys hopefully y'all enjoyed them two episodes from yesterday make sure you know what i'm saying if you ain't hadn't watched them go on watch them if you didn't watch the whole video go on watch the whole video gang and you know what i'm saying leave a thumbs up on there share it with your friends and family and these videos gonna keep coming no cap these videos is gonna keep coming gang so yeah we got a heavy schedule today no cap we just got to get all this stuff done. I'm just really go, ready to go check out this little rental company. Hopefully y'all like the rental company. And I went on and changed my mind on the little Vinewood Hill garage because um, we can't make no money from that. You know, it's just like a little garage we're going to have in there showcasing cars and stuff like that. So we might buy it later on, but for right now, we on a money-making mission, guys. We got to run that bag up. We trying to get us a, a nicer crib. We trying to get us some nicer cars. Even though we got not, we finna have nice cars right now, but we want something, you know, a little bit more better, guys. A little bit more better. We trying to get us some McLarens and Lambos and Ferraris. Y'all already know. We trying to live that lavish life. Get us a, a three-story mansion somewhere in the hills. Even though we already in the hills now, but... That crib look just like our little crib in the trenches. I thought it was gonna be a little bit more better, but I guess not. 
But we ain't gonna be staying in that crib too long, you know. We're gonna move out of that, cause uh it wasn't what I expected. Damn bro, you gonna run in the back of me, gang? You just gonna run in the back of your boy. We in traffic with it. So we pulling up on puns, big guys. Hopefully y'all like this chain we get. It's gonna be, you know what I'm saying? It's gonna be nice, you know, a little bit more shinier than the one we got on. A little bit more decent. We finna go on in here and drop this 100K. I hate to drop this, but we gotta shine out here, gang. I know y'all gonna like the chain. Y'all let me know what y'all think about the chain in the comments section. Let me know what y'all think about the fit we got on. You know, some some slight today, some slight, you know, look comfortable. But let's go on and, you know what I'm saying, have shouted to go in the back and get that chain for us. I sure hate to drop this 100,000, but we shining out here, no cap. Nice little LA chain, got diamonds everywhere, sparkling on our neck, diamonds dancing on our neck. Gonna drop that 100, that 100K. Ain't nothing to a baller, man. Ain't nothing to a baller. Look at it, though. Them diamonds dancing on there. Straight VVSs. That's what I'm talking about. So we're going to go ahead to this garage right now, guys. I'm going to get rid of this bad boy. Going to sell that junk. We can at least make a little bit of money back from it. Even though we didn't make the money that we spent for it. But we can make something back, you know what I'm saying? It's a, a nice little flip or something like that. But let's go ahead over here, guys to the garage business. And I don't know if I wanna take this car in there because I don't know how it's gonna act once I sell it. I don't know if it's just gonna kick me out of there. And then you know my car still be in there. And uh, I have to spun it back in. So I'm just gonna jump in probably like a Stolo or something like that and go and enter it and sell it. And I wanna see how much I'm gonna get back for it. Hopefully we get back what we paid or I know we ain't gonna get back more, so I ain't even expecting it. Um, but I'm expecting a little something, something. Our dealers, you know, they still got a little bit of money for us that we gotta pick up. But we gonna save that guy, cause we got so much to do in this episode. A lot to do, really. No cap. We got a lot to do, gang. Yeah, we finna get rid of this, man. Look at the, that Gucci in there. Gucci interior in this bad boy. But y'all know Simeon ain't gonna give us nothing for this, no cap. Just like the last episode, we only got 6,000 for the Caprice. And we paid like 28, 28,000. So yeah, that boy Simeon scamming your boy. Big scamming. But I ain't even tripping on that, you know what I'm saying? It's time for, for change, it's time for new new. We done drove these, you know, we done done a lot of dirt in these. So it's time to ride luxury. Luxury gang. And yeah, we uh we picking up a 2018 Rolls Royce Mansory Phantom in this episode. Had to go and jump Phantom. We're gonna drop 400,000 for it. Nice little 400,000. You know, I Googled it, and that's how much they really a little bit more than that in real life, but I just said I'd drop 400, 400 for it, you know. I ain't, I ain't dropping all the, the taxes and all that. We just gonna do a straight up 400K for the car. I'm gonna go around these bad boys. Fuck it. We going around police on it today. So yeah, guys, I gotta go and get rid of this business though. Cause there ain't too much we can do in there. I thought I'd be able to, you know what I'm saying? Jump in the cars, fix them up and stuff like that. But once you get in the garage, you cannot do nothing but go on your laptop. So that's the only reason why I said I was gonna go and sell this business. Cause we really can't move around in this business. And we can use this new business that we checking out in this episode. We can use that as like a little shop where we fix up cars. Cause I think it actually got a shop in there too. You know, once you get your rental in there, you can work on it and stuff like that. So, you know, that's a plus right there. We can go on and start buying us some you know what I'm saying? Some little low-key cars, fixing them up and selling them. You know, that'll be a decent little business. So I'm gonna go and just park this over here, guys. We'll just park it off over here, fuck it. Cause I don't wanna, you know what I'm saying, take no chances in losing this. And then I have to respun it back in. I really don't wanna steal no car, cause I really don't want the police on me. So let me see. Let me see if there's a car down here somewhere. Somewhere ducked off. 
I don't want to just do it in front of the police, but we do got people down here too. And it don't look like nothing ducked off over here. Nothing. I thought it was like a little parking garage over here, but I guess not. I guess not. So we just gonna do it like this, guys. I'm just gonna go over here across the highway. There's some people walking right there, but they ain't made it this far yet. Hopefully they don't see me. Dude turned around. All right, we good. We good. So don't nobody call the police on your boy. I just want to go and sell this real fast. And then we're going to go. We're going to go down to Simmon, pick up our new whip. And we're going to check out the two cars that we're going to be buying, too. So I'm just going to add all that money together, guys. Might as well, because, you know what I'm saying, go and get that over with. And we can go and call us a little towing service to tow them cars over to our new spot that we're going to have in this episode. Let me go and jump up out of here. Gonna sell this bad boy, guys. Let me see. Where do we sell it? I think an option. Sell garage. I'm gonna see if it's gonna kick us out of there. Yep, I knew it was gonna do that. And we got, oh, yeah, we got a nice little bag out there. No cap. What we paid for. So they gave us our money back. That's what's up. So I'm feeling that. I'm feeling that. So, yeah, guys, I'm gonna go pull up the cement first because, uh, you know, we got to take care of getting them cars towed there. And then I want to pick up my new car. Go on and sell this, too. Yeah, go on and get rid of this bad boy. Go on and get this out of my house. We'll be in luxury. I see y'all liked it, the, the uh, Lamborghini years, too. That were made by iSmacks, guys. I left a link in the description to the car. If y'all want to go get it, you know what I'm saying, off his website. And he got a lot of more cars on there, you know, you can pick from. So, uh, you know what I'm saying, y'all go check check out the website. Get some. Type in um, Code Savage Life. And you get, I think, I don't know if it's a 15% discount, but you get a little discount, guys, when you type in Code Savage. So, y'all better take advantage of that, you know what I'm saying. You get your cars, and plus you get a little discount when you type in Code Savage. So go on over there, you know what I'm saying? Get you some. For all you people who modding the game and stuff like that, go on and get you some. And y'all want to know where car is it? You know, that's a website, you know, reliable. As soon as you buy the car, you get the car. In a, you just download it. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no scamming or nothing like that. So y'all go check out iSmacks, though, guys. And you know what I'm saying? I'm going to leave a description for every car that I use in the description so y'all can get it, you know? I know a lot of y'all be asking, where, where you get this, where you get that? Just check out the description of the video. Go all the way to the bottom, guys. And everything I use in these videos, I uh, link them down there, unless I forget or something like that. But you know what I'm saying? Everything else is down in the description, like the little trap house I bought in the episode, well, the last episode before last. Uh, that's down in the description. Everything I use from now on, guys, I'm leaving it in the description for you guys. Because I know a lot of y'all be looking for them. Like when I started off mining and stuff like that, I used to look for stuff and I couldn't find it in the description. I'd be mad. So, I, you know what I'm saying? I know how y'all feel when you can't find it and you're trying to get it. So, I, that's why I just started leaving them in the description for y'all. So, y'all can go and check it out. You know, easy access to it. You don't have to be typing and searching you just go straight to the link and i know some of the links probably done expired because you know the uh, you know what i'm saying the creators of that car or whatnot probably ain't on the internet no more so i got i really do gotta go in my description and do a little bit of upgrading changing up some stuff because a lot of the my creator websites and stuff ain't working no more so i'm gonna have to go in there and redo my description but most of the stuff be at the bottom, guys. Go always scroll all the way to the bottom of the description and you'll see it. And let's go and get rid of this car right here. I'm already knowing we're gonna have to go down to the docks, but I ain't worried about that. We're gonna ask 30K for this, but I know we ain't gonna get that, so. Let's ho hopefully we get more than what we got for the other car. The other car sold for $6,000. That was highway scamming right there big scam so let's go on down to the docks I already knew we had to do that 
And we're gonna be jumping in that new new game once we uh drop this back out. We're gonna be jumping in that new new. Let me go and set that GPS down to the docks. And I'm gonna say 30k for this, no cap. We asking 30k. Even though we might get messing with Simmons, you might get 2k for this. But you know it is what it is, guys. We got we got plenty of money now. We got plenty of money coming in. We ain't gotta worry about nothing right now. My dealer got so much work in us uh, at the trap house in Grand Sonora, Sonata, Grand Sonata, whatever it's called. He got so much work over there, man. We 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 probably gonna pull in about a hundred k once he finished that. Then my uh, Dylan Mirror Park, he got work too, so. We steady got money coming in. We can go broke right now. We still gonna have some money. Money to go collect and your boy can get back on, you know what I'm saying? So let's go and get down here. Go and get this over with. This the, you know what I'm saying? This the longest part of this. Selling these cars. We gotta head all the way down here to the docks. I'm gonna go and put the pedal to the metal. Don't run that bad boy. Go around these bad boy. Ain't gonna show out today in this. Ain't gonna show out. But yeah, guys. Hopefully y'all like the little car rental place that we're gonna be buying in this episode. You know, um, we're gonna we're gonna be able to make a little bit of money off of it each day. I think like a thousand dollars a day. We're gonna be able to make off that. So that's a that's another plus, you know, from just renting cars. That's easy money. Thousand dollars a day. That's like seven thousand a week. So yeah, I mean it ain't it ain't a lot, but you know it's gonna add to the plate. We're gonna be eating steaks, eating shrimp. How many of y'all in the comments eat shrimp and crawfish and stuff like that in real life? I ain't gonna cap that crawfish be so fine. I love crawfish. Crawfish with the potatoes, the corn, the sausages. It's good. A delicacy. I think that's what they call it. Delicacy. Yeah, I love crawfish. I love crab legs. All that, guys. That's good eating, you know what I'm saying? Good eating. I don't know what this police got going on. He riding slow. Slow as hell. All right, guys, we done made it down here. I'm gonna say, bro, open that gate. This the most cars I done ever seen come down through here. These four must be going to work. I can understand this truck coming down here, but these cars, I ain't never just seen vehicle drive through here like this. They must have got a job down here or something. They driving slow, super slow. But let's go in here, guys. We're gonna have a 30K for this, no cap. Might add 35, but I do 30. That's just, you know what I'm saying, just to get up in here and out of here. We'll say 30 bands, gang. 30? All right, we good money. We're gonna head back to Simeon. All right, we back on the highway with it. Hold up, hold up. I know I said I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna do no stunning in it. I said I wasn't gonna do no stunning in it, but why not? Why not, gang? Why not? Why not? Do a little bit of stun. We're gonna get rid of this. Might well play in it. Might as well play in it. Sim ain't gonna have to worry about the repairs on this. We ain't gotta worry about it. All right, what's up with it, bro? Them boys on the clock over there. They on the clock. So yeah, guys, let me go and get this over and sell this so we can jump in the new whip. So y'all can see the new new. Hopefully y'all like the new new. I already told y'all what it is. 2018 Rolls Royce Phantom. The Mansory Edition. You know, I like I like them that Mansory shit on them cars. They be looking looking decent. Real decent. I know we're gonna have the stars in the roof and everything. 
That boy out here in the jalopy, ain't he? Jalopy. Hold up, let me swerve, let me swerve. Get on the side of this big truck and pass him. So yeah, this rental company should be a good investment. I don't know how much they asking for it, but we'll see once we get there, guys. Yeah, we'll see once we get there. We're gonna drop that bag, though. We're gonna drop it like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Push the pedal to the metal. Pedal to the metal. Damn, I bumped it. I was trying to stop, but yeah, them brakes wouldn't let me. Them brakes need a little bit of upgrade. Go on, go, bro. Yeah, them brakes, I ain't put no gas in here or nothing. No gas. We almost to our destination. We almost to our destination, gang. Hold up now. It's gonna pull up in here. Before I total this out. We gotta go and drop this bag to send me in too, no cap. Alright, we in here. Go on take that, brother. Don't take that. See what he gonna give me for that. We waiting for a buy. But let's go check out what we picking up right now. And this is what we picking up, guys. The 2018 Rolls Royce Phantom. The Mansory Edition. Looking good. No cap. 400 bands, it better look good. It best to look good for 400. Y'all see the little Mansory shit on there? Yeah. And these are the other vehicles, guys, that we're going to be buying in this episode. But we're going to have a towing company to uh, deliver them down to our new rental dealership. Two Hellcats. We're running a Hellcat rental dealership. We ain't going to have nothing but Hellcats, probably Trackhawks and stuff like that on the dealership. But let's go ahead and chop it up with Simeon real quick. So we're going to drop him 480 Four, yeah, 480,000. We're gonna drop that bag to my boy Simon. Let's go on get it, gang. All right, guys. So we dropped that little bag off to Simon. $480,000. We're gonna drop that off, guys. We're gonna go over here and uh, we're gonna go on and I guess go down to the airport. Because that's where the little car rental service at, guys. You know, a nice little decent spot. People come in out of town or whatnot. They ain't got no transportation and stuff like that. They can just pull up to my little rental service. Go on and, you know what I'm saying, get them a Hellcat or something like that. And you know what I'm saying, they'll be good money. They will be good money, gang. So let's get it. We headed on. We headed on down to the airport right now. Go check it out. You know, go on, drop this bag on it and whatnot, guys. Gonna get it over with. We went on sold the little garage business, made a nice little chunk of change off that, no cap. And I gotta check out the insides of this too once we once we get down there. Check out the insides of this car. So yeah guys, we ain't got far to travel. And that's what's up, you know what I'm saying? We finding ways to make us a lot of money. Get money out here. That's the plan. Get rich, gang. Simi ain't got no gas in this bad boy. Nothing at all. Damn, bro. Simi be scamming, bro. He leave you with no gas. Oh, this the inside, guy. Yeah, he want to leave you with no gas. Undercut your own cars and stuff like that. I'm swerving through traffic. Yo, let's get it. We headed down here. Oh, this mug sound good. No cap. This mug sound good. So, yeah, guys, you can get this car from Nukem's Customs. I'm going to uh, leave it down in the the description for you guys if y'all want to check this car out. And, or, you know what I'm saying, check out Nukem's website or whatnot. Because he got a website, too, with cars. So, 
Y'all can check him out too. It's like we gotta go around the little loop de loop. But hopefully y'all like the little car rental spot. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this episode too, gang. Y'all yeah, here taking care of business. Okay, guys, so I believe we gotta keep straight right here. And then we can pull up right here. This the little spot. This the spot that we're gonna be buying right now, guys. We're gonna get our cars delivered down here. I'm gonna bag in right here. Yeah, we'll bag in right here. All right, let's go see what it looked like in the inside. See how much they asking for. Okay, they want 150,000 daily income, $1,376. That's what's up. So we might have to call the little global company to buy this. But this is what we looking at, guys. You know, it's a little small space, but we can make some money out this, no cap. We can make some money. Y'all see they got a lot of vehicles up here. I guess this, the last people who had this, these are the cars that they was offering. They had limos. We might have to get us a limo too, no cap. Get us a nice little limo. But yeah, it's a little small spot, guys. But you know, we can make a lot of money out of this. That's all that matters. So I'm gonna go buy this real quick. So I'm soon we gotta call the little company. I forgot about that. Call the little global dealer. I mean the yeah, global investment. And we done bought this property, guys. We got us a nice little car rental spot touchdown car rentals i'm gonna get on the phone with the little towing service and we're gonna have them to deliver the cars down here guys okay guys so the driver he had to make two trips but he brought both of the cars over here got him sitting in front of the rental company we're gonna go drop him off a little bit of bread we'll give him a nice little tip guys i'll give him about five bands i guess about 5,000, you know what I'm saying, for helping us out today. Really appreciate him. Let's go drop him this little cake real quick. He had a nice little five bands for him. Appreciate him. And hopefully y'all enjoyed this episode. Like, share, comment. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Links in the description. Gang, gang.